survive. Battle and survive. Mirrors off. Mirrors off. All right, so that's just what we're going to do today. Again, this is a review of what we've already learned in science about structures and functions. So we're just going to jump right in. We are going to start with a timed pair share. So our question is, if you could be any animal, what would you be and what structures and functions would you have? So I want to give you some think time to think about that, how you're going to respond to your partner. Okay, so let's have some think. When I say go, A is going to start. Thumbs up if you're A. All right, so we're clear on who is going to start us off on our timed pair share. Okay, you're going to have 30 seconds, and I want A to go now. They have tails and have everything and goes up like tails, and then they have claws over here, and they can see at night and all those things. So good job on that. Now. I want B to respond, but before I want B to respond, I want us to give A a praise. So I want B to say, you take the cake. You, you take, take the, the cake. cake. All right, so let's say we are going to, the question is, name as many colors as you can. Let's say I start. Red. Pink. Blue. Orange. Red. Green. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Red again. So, that, do you see how we didn't really stop? We just bounced ideas back and forth. So we've already, this morning, looked at different structures and functions. We've kind of discussed what animal we would be, what structures and functions we would have. So now we're just simply going to name structures that help animals survive. And you do not have to use one from the picture. I just thought I'd throw that up there just to remember. This is just sort of for a review. So first, I want you to show me some think time. Think about some responses you can have for your partner. This time, I want B to start my rally robin for me. Okay, thumbs up if you're B. Okay, so when I say go, I want B to start naming some structures that help animals survive. Ready and go. Again, we have our poster we can refer back to. So if I'm partner A, I'm going to solve and explain aloud. B is going to watch and listen. Now the purpose in us solving aloud, thinking aloud, is so that my partner can see if I'm on the right track, okay? Because they don't want me to go ahead and write down an answer that might be wrong that they need to coach me on. If your partner A, I want you to circle all of your answers. If you are partner B, I just want you to underline your answer. <laughs> Camouflage would go under structure. Well, let's look at that again. Camouflage would, um, so camouflage is a function because, like, swimming is an active thing, climbing is an active thing, and then camouflage is, like, a thing that, like, Oh, okay, I understand active. now. Okay. Camouflage is